Let's see how the Visual Kanban Toolboard can aid real estate management processes. The two boards we'll look at serve a company that builds, sells, and maintains city apartment complexes, but here, we'll concentrate only on their sales and maintenance workflows. The swim lanes of the sales pipeline board stand for each building in the final construction stage. The columns represent the stage of negotiations with individual clients, who, in turn, are visualized with task cards. The process starts with the lead stage, divided into first contact, second and third. Here's where the realtor takes time to answer all questions, showcase the offer, follow up regarding a decision, and provide special incentives for undecided clients. The negotiation stage is for ironing out all the details and specifications of the apartment's final state, price, and move-in date. It also includes the closing stages, contract sent and contract signed. Once all is agreed, the client's task is moved to the deal closed stage. Splitting the flow like this helps keep tabs on many clients buying potentially similar condos at comparable prices, all at the same time. It's easy to get things muddled up, so using the state of each client's negotiations as the main immediately visible piece of information helps a lot. After the sale, there is also a follow-up stage. It's reserved for checking how the move-in went, whether everything is up to scratch, and to ask for the client's general feedback. A few additional Kanban tool features are aiding the sales process. The team uses the standard due dates feature to know when each task needs attention and applies filters to speed up finding tasks for the day. They also use task reminder emails for crucial items, for instance those that need help from another team member or a contractor. Each task has a customizable ID, which is the client's primary phone number. That helps when needing to quickly identify the previously stated wishes of the person on the phone. Still, once known, the client's wishes and information are shown on the card fronts through task summary. Now, for the apartment's management process board. The objective is keeping an eye on when regular maintenance operations are needed in each building. For easier viewing, the board rows show buildings and sometimes floors, while the columns are the various types of maintenance work needed. It is not a standard Kanban board, operating on tasks making their way from one side to the other, as the work happens. Instead, task cards pop up in a given place with due dates. Once a specific technical check is done, the task is archived for the record, but its copy will come back in the same spot after a set time, through recurring tasks. Replacing a flow with static jobs makes it possible to quickly filter when each building or its part need work, so that arrangements with the apartment owners are made well ahead of time. Information on contracted technicians involved in some of the jobs is available from the pin board. With these boards, the condo sales team and the building managers enjoy a well-organized, foreseeable, and highly visual process flow. If you're curious what else Kanban tool can be used for, please view the other use case examples. Also, you're welcome to try the system with your team for free. Set up an account in minutes on KanbanTool.com 